hello assalamu alaikum friends welcome back to my new tutorial of factory talk view me so in this video we are going to discuss about the tank levels and our orthogonal buttons means multi state button in our factory talk view me so let's see what i will do that so i am just uh, you will see here is my screen shut down button in the previous video you will also understand the navigations momentary buttons and display indicators and and symbols visibility so in this in this video you will understand a more understand a maintain means a multi state button and a tell tank level you will see and a numeric entry and and also numeric display so first of all you will see i have some tags which i will use in our in our hmi design so first of all i am going to show you a select a push button and you will see i am using a multi state push button and it has currently two states zero states means it it is auto i am just selecting a white color for it and one means manual you will see it is our menu so we have our auto manual tag i am going to give it going to apply i also going to make connection for it and select member manual so you will see our manual button has now been created so i need to check it is working or not so i am just run my screen so you will see it is going to work or not so let's see what happened so our screen is open and now you will see i is going to select auto it is now manual and you will see it is work working i think i am going to show you there so you will understand it is working manual and auto so that's it now i am going to show you about an american pitch so first of all i need a some display bar that is okay i will i think i need to make it the black color black color and i need to select that the dark green which is good and i am going to select some text and i am going to draw it there and i am going to name it as set point ST point, which is black and four color. I think good. I think I need to change to black to white, which is looking good. I need then selecting this layer, and I am going to select that as a error. It's display or error. So I. I am going to show you how we use an American input, and an uh, American display. So first of all, I am going to object and select a one American display. Draw it there, and I think that's okay. And I am going to select error as a our American display. And number of digits, I think the three is. Uh, Better than the one decimal, and I am going to select border color. I think don't need a border color. That's okay. Well, border color is right now. I am going to select that. Green is better. Red is better. Let's see. That is not good. Looking good, I think. That right. I need. I need a white one is better. So now I am going to select uh, a numeric input. See, a numeric writing push button. Numeric input.
from this window and it is opening the keypad it also has a level just I am going to make a connection for a value and set point I think I select the wrong one, but let's see. Let's see it is working or not. I'm just going to save it and continue my screen I think something is going to make a mistake Now I'm going to save then I'm going to check it is working or not. Anything it is again not working work. I'm going to bring a numeric display in a review. Number of digit three, number of decimal four. I think I think that is our numeric input. I'm going to transmit the connections and uh, set point apply and okay. Let's see what to save and running it. That is it. It's going to work. But I think the color is gone, it don't show the color. So I'm just going to open that and make it I think larger. Oh, now it is showing some color. I'm just going to save it and run again. So
So that's it. how our numeric input and numeric display and uh, multi-state button work in our FD talk view and me. So thank you very much for watching my video. Please subscribe my channel, like my video and click the bell icon and comments if you don't understand anything. So I will make video on that video. So thank you very much again for watching my video. Thank you very much.